Brett's assault on me dra drastically altered my life. Too emotional. Vicious and false additional accusations. Too angry. Will be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. No one can say for sure who was telling the truth at Thursday's historic Supreme Court nomination hearing. Dr. Christine Blasey Ford or Judge Brett Kavanaugh. She definitely knows what she's talking about. So we sat down with body language expert Renate Moussou to break down their testimony based on Ford and Kavanaugh's mannerisms, movements and emotion. Body language has nothing to do with political views. It is simply observing a person's body language. I was pushed onto the bed. Musu noticed right away that Ford was about. nervous and emotional talking about the alleged sexual assault, but says at no time did she fidget with her hands, face or neck, which is often a sign of someone not being truthful. Ford also answered questions quickly, without wavering, another indication of honesty. She is totally sure of herself, gives spontaneous answers, doesn't weaver in her answers. She comes across as very believable. It's been harmful to me and my family. During Judge Kavanaugh's testimony, Musu pointed out how angry he was with a constant frown and wrinkled nose. The body language expert told us Kavanaugh seemed a little over the top, and in her opinion, that can sometimes mean you have something to hide. If you are a attacked and you just want to defend yourself and say, hey, you got it all wrong, I haven't done this. You are talking in a lower voice, your movements are not so aggressive, so it comes across to me as not being genuine.